For all your t-shirt needs, check out Tee Public's Killer Selection. Follow the link in the description. Hey, what's up, people? Piz out here, and this is the 40th anniversary Texas Chainsaw Massacre five disc Black Maria box set. Now, this set was first released back in 2014 to celebrate the 40th anniversary of Friday the 13th. And when this set was first released, I opted to not get it, I passed on picking up this set. And instead I got the four disc 40th anniversary collectors edition uh, Blu-ray DVD combo pack. Now I did a video discussing this release and all the extras. I'll put that link in the description. Go over and check that video out. But I opted to pick up this release over the Black Maria edition because of the price. When this was first released, I want to say this thing went for like 80 bucks maybe more and i kind of didn't i didn't i i just didn't like it um i didn't like the look of it and i thought for the extra you know 50 60 bucks um that it took to purchase this release over this release there just wasn't enough inside to warrant that price tag however um, since Toby Hooper passed away, I've had a lot of, I've felt a lot of chainsaw nostalgia. And um, for some reason, this set popped into my head the other day. And I thought to myself, this set has to be long out of print at this point. It's probably going online for hundreds of dollars. I jumped on Amazon and I was surprised to see that Amazon had these they had a limited quantity however but they were selling these for fifty dollars so i jumped at the opportunity to finally pick up the black maria a 40th anniversary texas chainsaw massacre five disc set and i wanted to uh share it with you guys kind of do an unboxing or an untrucking if you will um of this set but here it is it looks like the uh the Black Maria, the rig at the end of the film, the gentleman jumps out of and throws the um, the wrench at Leatherface and kind of kind of saves, um, <laughs> you know, it kind of saves the day. And then he runs off, and we just he runs one way, and Marilyn jumps into a truck and goes the other way, and we just never see the guy again. So we just assume that he he survived. He ran off, and you know, maybe he found a nice Texan woman and settled down and he had a wild story to tell her about this crazy, you know, big guy in a suit with a mask made of human flesh chasing after this little blonde haired woman. And I threw a wrench at him and saved the day. And I was driving my black Maria truck that day. So this set is supposed to be a replica of that gentleman's truck. And you can even see the, uh, the scratches there from the chainsaw on the door, that leather face, um, leather face kind of branded the door with, uh, with the chainsaw. And, um, on the back of it here, we have got, um, uh, some specs for this release and it's signed by Toby Hooper. Not sure if that's a real legit signature. It actually kind of looks like a real legit signature. So I'll probably hold on to it um, here on the uh, bottom you see everything that's included inside here it's got the same four commentaries that were on the other release um, collector's edition bonus disc that was on the other uh, release and exclusive to just this release we've got the Leatherface apron the 40th anniversary theatrical mini poster and an exclusive bonus disc the Cine family presents Friedkin Hooper, a conversation about the Texas Chainsaw Massacre between William Friedkin and Toby Hooper. I have never seen that. I'm really looking forward to checking that out um, as a matter of fact. 
So let's go ahead and let's open this baby up and um, yeah, let's let's take a look at it. Um, there's the top. There, of course, is the bottom. There's the back. There's there's the front. I like the the personalized uh, license plate there. And uh, there's the the other side. So yeah, let's go ahead and tear this baby open and let's, let's take a look at it. And uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna hold on to this. I'm not sure if that's a legit signature or not. I mean, what do you guys think? I don't know. It kind of looks like it is. I, I'll hold on to it. I never got to meet Toby Hooper at a convention and have him sign anything. So that's, you know, there's only a few people that I've really wanted to meet at conventions that I never got the opportunity to meet. Um, and now unfortunately never will. Toby Hooper is one. Wes Craven is another. And of course, Angus Scrim uh, is a third. Now there is some damage to this, um, to this one here. I noticed a little bit of damage there. Um, and, 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 and it wasn't from the delivery. It wasn't from my postal service. I have to say the box that this came in was, um, pristine. This was something in, uh, the warehouse. I'm sure just a little damage there. Not that big a deal. Don't know if I'll call Amazon and complain about that or not. I mean, you guys know how, how much of a stickler I am that, um, even the packaging for these, um, these editions have to be in perfect shape, but um, yeah, I don't know. And even if I did call at this point, I don't know if there's any more of these on Amazon for 50 bucks. Like I said, there was a limited quantity when I looked uh, or when I picked this one up. I will put a link to the uh, Amazon listing in the description. Go over and check it out. If you passed on this release like I did for so many years and you want to pick it up at a pretty reasonable price I think I'll put that link below uh, hopefully they will still have some but uh, let's go ahead and open this bad boy up as you can see there's a there's a handle there so let's open him up and oh cool okay so inside here is all the goodies now what you can do with this box is you can kind of set it like this if you have room to sit it like this on a shelf or somewhere and it looks like the the full on, uh, the full on truck. Yeah, pretty cool. Let's put that aside for right now and let's dive in and see what we've got here. We've got, we've got the discs. Very nice artwork there, I do believe. Here's all the, uh, all the extras, all the content. Pretty loaded. Really looking forward to checking out the exclusive bonus discs. Oh, and. Um, I believe the case is, the case is broken. Yes, the case is broken. Let me see if that will um, have a piece of piece of case come flying out of there. Um, yeah. So I, it still opens and closes and, and locks and everything's appears to be in pretty good order. So I don't. Eh. Not that big a deal, I guess. Not that big a deal. But let's see. Let's check this out. Here is the poster. If I can get it out of there. And now the the artwork on this poster is really, really cool. That is so cool. Let me see if I can get this out for you guys so you guys can see it. 40th anniversary, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. A film by Toby Hooper, the most terrifying motion picture I've ever seen, says Rex Reed. Still packs the same punch it did when it first changed the face of horror, says Indy Wire. There's the, uh, the armadillo. There's the, uh, there's the van. Here's the markings that the hitchhiker left on the van. Um, yeah, this is a really, really cool poster. I love the, uh, the artwork there. That is just really, really cool. Here is the poster in all of its glory, flattened out. Love, love this artwork here. Great, great artwork, I have to say. Beautiful stuff. And here are the discs. There's the limited edition. I'm not sure if that's going to stay in there. Yeah, probably not. Here is the limited edition, the feature film. 
Here is the limited edition bonus disc. Here we've got the DVD, the feature film, DVD of the bonus disc, and here is the exclusive uh, bonus disc exclusive to this set. Really looking forward to checking out that conversation between Toby Hooper and William Friedkin about the film. Very cool. Let's see what else we got in here. We've got <laughs> we've got the apron. Ed, the apron isn't anything particularly special. I mean, it's just a it's uh, like a replica apron that Leatherface wore in the movie although i think the one he wore in the movie was yellow this one is like a gray kind of color um I, I mean it is what it is it's not um <laughs> you know it it is what it is I, i'm not even going to take it out of the um out of the little baggie here um i guess they 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 had to throw something extra in this set um, and they thought, hey, what about just a, a cheap apron? We'll throw some blood on it. And, um, yeah, so, I mean, it is what it is. Um, hey, it is what it is. So, yeah, to uh, recap the contents of the 40th anniversary Texas Chainsaw Massacre Black Maria edition, we have the blood-spattered uh, Leatherface a uh, apron replica. We have got the discs with the bonus disc exclusive just to this release. We have got the really cool poster, which I, I won't undo it again, but you guys saw the, uh, the artwork on it. Really, really nice poster. And it all goes together inside a replica of the Black Maria truck from the texas chainsaw massacre um yeah i you know this i'm really happy that i finally bought this i know it's not you know in 50 bucks maybe a little much for this set but i am glad that i bought it and that i added it to the collection and again if you guys are interested in picking up this set for 50 bucks from amazon Follow the link in the description. If you like this video, please leave it a thumbs up. If you're not following me on social media, those links are in the description. As always, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Take care, and until next time, peace. internet jeremy hello to the internet